after Twitter decided to permanently ban U.S. President Donald Trump, largely unmoderated Palo social networks soared in popularity. But now Apple and Google have removed Palo from their app stores and sending the social media network. Palo offline tech giant Amazon has also suspended it from its web hosting service. The move comes in the wake of deadly riot at the U.S. Capitol as it allowed threats of violence, messages of support for the Reuters and the calls for new demonstrations had flourished on the platform. This led to Google to uh, this led Google to remove it from its app store followed by Apple on Saturday. It is favored by many supporters of the US President Donald Trump and it is seen as a haven for people expelled from Twitter. In a letter to Palo first published by BuzzFeed, Amazon said that there has been a steady increase in violent content on the website, all of which violates Amazon's terms of service. The letter also said that the network was not acting quickly enough against violent content on the platform. The social networking service, popular with many right-leaning social media users, has not taken adequate measures to prevent the spread of the posts inciting violence. Amazon has moved Viped from its cloud hosting Amazon Web Services, and Amazon's move effectively takes the site offline unless it can find a new company to host its services. Questioning t Twitter's decision to suspend uh, Trump's account, Russian opposition leader Alexei Navalny posted a long thread on Twitter. Navalny said that Trump was not banned for violating Twitter rules and that he himself has been getting death threats every day on uh, Twitter for many years, but Twitter doesn't ban anyone. He also said if Twitter wants to do things right, they need to create some sort of committee that can make such decisions. And we do know that the names of the members of the committee understand how it works, how its members vote, and how we can appeal against their decisions. We will not take it anymore, and that's what this is. Other mainstream social media networks like Facebook, Instagram, Snapchat, and Twitch have also suspended Trump following the attack on Capitol. And Matsi has said that the platform has many options for moving ahead. Palo also said that it started in 2018 and was initially a home for extreme right but now it attracts more traditional conservative voices, including Republican lawmakers. Beyond is now available in your country. Download the app now. Get all the news on the move.